Let's suppose you have a document like the one you see on the screen. And you understand how to use the style bar to control the size, shape, look, and feel of every paragraph in your document. But you keep using the same kinds of things over and over and you'd like a bit more variety. I'd like to show you how to add a lot of color variation to the same document without going back and redesigning all these styles individually, but how you can make them change with simply the click of a mouse and cause the whole document to look different. We're going to go to the Design tab on the very top. And when I ha have the Design tab, I have a, a subset of items called Document Formatting. It starts out on the left side with the current style that's in the document. But notice what happens as I begin to move my mouse over these other options. I can see in real time on my document uh, different kinds of controls of style formatting. And if I find one I like, I can go ahead and click on it and it will be applied to my document. Or if I want to change it to another one, I simply click on that. If I click on the down arrow, I see I have another host of options here that control it. And every time I move the mouse over a particular box, it will change it according to the, the characteristics of that particular set of style controls. And so I can change it as much as I want on a single click. I haven't changed the style, I've changed the definition behind the style. And if I want to go back to where I started, I click on the More button on the lower right corner and just say Reset to the default style, and I'm back where I started. Another option you have besides these variations is one called Themes. I'm going to click on my Theme box, and here I have a host of themes that also add another layer of control over my document. So with a single click, I can click on this theme here and it will also change the features of the document. And under that theme, I can also change by clicking here anywhere in any of these controls for different kinds of um, components for my document. You notice when I click on the themes button, the colors box change. And that's uh, one big area that it adds. So I have two ways in which to change a document on a single click. I'll try another one of these. There's a blue one. Here we go to a, a brownish one. Here's one called Celestial uh, Dividend. And I can go down the scroll bar and pick a, a, a wide variety using different color patterns as well for my themes. Let's click on this one for now and then I can also vary it with the formatting options I see here to fit whatever I prefer at the moment. Again, if I want to go back to my default, I click down here, I say reset, reset to default style. I can do the same on my themes, reset to theme from template, and I'm back where I started. But if you'd like to make some dramatic changes on a single click or two clicks of your entire document, just for variety's sake, this is a great tool in Microsoft Word. When you're looking for variety in Microsoft Word documents, the Design tab is a great place to go. With a single click of a mouse, you can change the look and feel of your entire document. I'm Jim from the Sharper Turtle, and I'd like to thank you for allowing us the privilege of helping you grow in your knowledge of this piece of software. If you find this lesson useful, we'd like to ask you to like us, leave any comments you wish, and subscribe so that we can deliver to you other lessons that will help answer questions and solve problems as you grow in your knowledge of Microsoft Word. Thank you.